Hey everybody, today you're going to hear from us from our children as they give you some insight about what it's like growing up with a parent who has a disability. In today's car ride and conversation with the blind guy, his wife, and their life. Y'all guys ready to rock and roll? Yeah. Y'all guys trust me? Yeah. All right, so Corey, go ahead and drive. I'll tell you where to go since you can't see. Let's start with you turn the left a little bit because there's a car right there on the right. So, yeah, today we're going to talk about how, up. how the kids feel about some of the experiences that we had as a, having a blind so right parent. A now, a story I can remember when Brooklyn was about five or six years old, a neighbor came over to play, and I was going to turn on the water sprinklers for them so that they could just go ahead and play and have some summer fun. And the kid, he asked, well, how's your dad going to turn on the sprinklers? Because I had to climb under some bushes to do it because he can't see. My dad can do do a lot of things even though he can't see. He changes all sorts of diapers on my little sister. He helps us with homework. So I was feeling pretty good about that, that my daughters you know, felt comfortable about that, about having a blind parent and they didn't see any much difference between me and other parents. But let's ask them this question. We want to talk about, one of the questions we talk about a lot is, what do you guys think would be different or that I might be doing different or we might be doing differently if I could see? So Christiana, what do you think would be different? We wouldn't be able to cut lines at different parts. <laughs> We wouldn't be able to cut the lines at the theme park. Straighten up? No, you can keep bearing left for right now. Now, straighten up a little bit. Now, that, that's true. We do get to go straight left a little bit, left left. We do go to theme parks. And actually, Corey, you've been invited to theme parks with family members, like your cousins. They were like, hey, Corey, we're going to the Bush Gardens on the 30th, but can you go with us? Yeah, and mainly because they want to get to the front of the flash pass to the front of the line. Yeah, because if you have a disability, then you can go left you can go to the front of the line left 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 we got to get this truck straighten up you can go to the front of the line uh quicker like left left so corey who's next with answering what about you coco what do you think straighten up. what do you think would be different if i could see right now i think you would be like um, he'd be doing what x-ray x-ray yeah in my left. former life i was an x way. i was an x-ray tech I, at one of the local hospitals i took x-rays and um and it's just cat scans and things of that nature so of course can't do that when you can't see anymore so i had to stop that and do something different now and those things don't work out straight up like so, all the way around till it's straight yeah so we got special guests in the car today we got pierce and Archie. pierce you've been featured in yeah. I, i'm blind and i still beat the kids videos my rob <laughs> Gronkowski. so what do you think would be different if i um was actually could see well, I think you'd be able to play football because right. I think you'd be a really good quarterback. Oh, oh, cool. I oh, appreciate that. Quarterback. Please. Quarterback. So, wait. Uh, oh, no. The police is in the... Oh, straight. No, keep going. Just keep driving. Okay, we're just going to pretend like we know what we're doing. Keep going. Just keep going. Boy, straight to the right a little bit. Where are at, though? <laughs> to the right. Look out the window. Okay, let's keep going. We're almost done with this video. Left, Corey, left. You can't be messing up in front of the cops. Stop. Oh, my goodness. Don't stop. Just keep going. Left, left, left. Keep going. Left, 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 left. Straighten up. Buddy, answer the question. What do you think Daddy would be doing left if he could see right now? Straighten up. Straighten up. Keep your hands on the wheels. So I think he would be able to drive. Better than I'm doing now, right? Maybe he could also teach him how to dance. No. I couldn't dance, but I could see, so I'm not gonna dance now. <laughs> well, yeah, I think you'll be able to drive and like not crash. Yeah, like this is like yeah, that's not riding the bus. Like if he's not working, he had a car. He yeah. could drive us to school, and if you were working, you could drive. He could just drive us to school. We could have the bus and stuff like that. Huh? Okay, that's true. He could drive you to school. Um, and then Audrey, what is your answer? If Mr. Corey can see to the right, because she's probably looking at his car, we about to hit. If she could see left, left, not turn right. If Mr. Corey could see, what do you think would be different? Like, what would he be? What would he be doing left, turn left? I think that he would probably yeah. be doing probably be doing football, like like what you said. Oh, yeah, I, don't, I don't think I'd be actually playing football, but I probably would be out there coaching. I actually coached the little league team for a little while. Uh, even after I lost my sight, yeah, I coached as an offensive line coach. Yeah. I had them boys popping too. And so, yeah, so that was fun, but I probably definitely would be in high school 
or he maybe even a college coach guy probably would want to go further in my uh, coaching career. So I hope you enjoyed this conversation with a blind guy, his wife, and everybody. <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, ding ding for more videos. <laughs> <laughs>